Hello all and welcome to my latest episode on my Liverpool rebuild. This is episode number 10. Um, last episode we we did the transfer deadline. We had a little bit of money to spend. Literally on deadline day I decided to go ahead and I will show you who I signed. I signed this fella Antonio Silva uh, I signed him for I believe it was around 30, 30 33 million pounds there's a few extras in there as as you do um, he's worth 70 already um, we got him on a good deal um, he's got a four and a half year deal there Honestly, really good bit of business, I think, there. He's a player I wanted originally. His physicals are fantastic there as it goes. Um, I, I can't complain if I'm going to be completely honest. Uh, season's going really well. We are three points behind City in the league. We've got two games in hand. Superior goal difference. We are just about to face Dynamo Kiev in the second leg of the Europa League. Uh, as you can see there, breezy light snow, minus 7. Jay Spearing is unhappy at Liverpool with a concern about playing time. Okay. Can I even do anything about this, or...? I can. He wants a loan. Um, complacency. Players are professional. If Jay Spearing is going to go down that route, I will just go one better. Quite shocked that he actually feels like He can go down that route. I mean, look, he's he's worth eight thousand pounds. We're gonna offer him out. We'll offer him on loan. I, I'm not even really worried about this. This is, it's quite laughable to be honest. I've just forwarded by accident. Uh, this is a player I have got my eyes on. I think he could be an absolute baller, by the way, this Paul Wanner. Um, I really like the look of him, to be completely honest. I need to go back and I need to complete that Jay Spearing. Always, forever, hitting the wrong buttons. Offer to club. We will offer to clubs. And even if he's not loaned out, we will look to sell him. There's still some big teams in this, you know. So we do have a healthy advantage. Andre Santos is going to come in. Okay, so... It's going to be Ramsey that's going to be replaced here. By Jordan Henderson. Uh, I think we're going to play for Farner up top. We will play Diego Jota on the left. On the right, Fabio Carvalho. Honestly, I believe the job is practically done and dusted. We will pair. Konate in there we will play Simakas I, I kind of feel like that this is the team that needs to play there, there's no need to go mad here it, that, that's how we're going to start that's where we're going to go with 4-1 up from the first leg quietly confident Look at this pitch. We've got the dramatic music of the Europa League. We love it. The Barneys get prepared for warmer weather and come back to us.
Right, away we go on this dodgy pitch. Gonna fire the boys up. They literally need a fire in this snowy, snowy conditions. I'll even take a nil-nil draw here. Preferably, I would like a win. But we don't always get what we want, so... It's very much all us. I did did expect that to be the case. Second half, we might have to put some of the uh, bigger fellas on. Fabinho is now suspended for the next match. Andre Santos has scored here. Jota with a cutback, plenty of time, fizzed in, in off the post. And that is a cracking goal for Andre Santos. Jota has just doubled our lead. Santos with the ball over Detro. Good tackle. But Jota is on hand to put it away. And make us 2-0 to the good. And this works for me resting some of our players. And I believe that's Jota again. Oh. Fafana's getting very close to getting getting in great positions. It's not quite working out for him. But it's basically causing so much mayhem in the box that Jota is benefiting. We're pleased. We're going to keep this going. It's good to see Jota back in. And on form, to be honest. Kiev have got one back. Tyson Gankov with the cross. And Olinik gets in ahead of Antonio Silva. And pulls one back for Kiev and makes it 3-1. Trent Anderson... Trent Anderson, that's what one of my golf boys. Trent Alexander Arnold is done. We will make the change. Fabinho will come on at full back for him. Do you know what? That probably was the right sub with Henderson. I just needed to do this. <laughs> Something along them lines. We'll also change Thiago up. We'll put on Joe Bellingham. If I can ever find him. There he is. Give the boys a bit of game time. Whilst giving uh, Trent a... A rest. Detro has run his cause here, I believe. It'll be Harvey Elliott that comes on for him. I'm having a nightmare again. We'll bring on Harvey Elliott. Fabinho for Bajetic. It's absolutely fine. We're 7 2 up on aggregate. And it's a uh, a fourth goal on the day for us. Andre Santos into Jordan Henderson. Ball over the top. Harvey Elliott nips in and crashes one into the far corner. 
four one in each leg. That will do us. We advance. Very good. There's still going to be some really good teams in here. Just seeing that Mohamed Kudos has scored as well. Quick question. Brilliant goal from Andre Santos. Fabinho is now suspended. No club considers a deal for Jay Spearing viable. And that's literally over nothing. We will view the draw. Club Bruges, Manchester United, Chelsea, Feyenoord, Arsenal, Real Sociedad, Ajax, Lazio, Freeburg, Rangers, Eintracht Frankfurt, Roma, Dinamo, Rennes and Liverpool. I didn't even see who I just drew. BRG. That's Braga from Portugal. That's Braga. Okay, interesting. Just like this game we're about to play, Brentford at home. Interesting. I don't think this is going to be an easy game. Yes, they are in 16th. And I believe they got a draw out of me back at home for them. Manchester United have just been dismantled by Tottenham. I think in a way that's going to completely curb any chance of catching us up. Okay, it makes us as easy winners. We shall see. Man City are in the League Cup final against Newcastle. Darwin... Jota with a really good performance, but we're going to have to go with Luis Diaz. We're going to put Jordan Henderson in there just for the experience for the game. Virgil can come back, as can Andrew Robertson. <clears throat> I nearly <clears throat> forgot about Mo Salah for a moment. <clears throat> All right, let's just see. <clears throat> who we are not selecting. Ramsey, Jones. That's about right, if I'm honest. Joel Matic can't even get a look in now. Silver's coming, and that's practically been his lot. Let's go. Let's get it. Big game this. Would absolutely love a win here. <laughs> a Liverpool fullback gets a yellow card. Could you believe it? Demanded more early, we get a goal. Fabinho into Robertson, whose cross is met by Darwin Nunez, who has finally scored. I think he has scored one goal in the previous, what, maybe three episodes. He hasn't scored a lot of goals, so. And then he comes and gets his second. Zakowska trying to pass it out. Salah with the ball in. 
and Nunez with an easy finishing off the post gives us a 2 0 lead, and these goals are very well needed for him. It's um, it's been a long time coming. Now, interestingly enough, we are down to ten men. Andrew Robertson has been red carded. Simakas is going to have to come on and he's going to replace Jordan Henderson. Not ideal that this has happened. Something like that. We're still going to play attacking if... If uh, they get one back, I might have to play a little bit more structured. Well, Simakas has just scored his first Liverpool goal. Salah with the ball across, and that's a really good finish here. So, going down to 10 men hasn't affected us at all at right now. So, this is a good thing. I fully expect a lot of my players are going to tie out a little bit more now. The three points is the important part. Okay, it is looking good. XG is only over one. We're going to be pleased. Let's get it going. I'm going to praise the boys. Trent. What we have to do with Trent is we need to bring on a midfielder for him if I can ever get there. We're going to swap him out. If I can ever find the right players. Andre Santos. Fabinho is going to go in at fullback. That's about the best thing we can do there. Nunez has got himself a hat trick. Oh, it's a good save. But Nunez is out just and tapping the rebound to make it a hat trick. To be honest, it's been a long time coming. Now Fabinho has gone down with a knock. We're going to have to put Canate in at right back. And Ivan Tony has got one back. I'm not sure. Well, I must have just deflected off him and sort of gone in. It is 4-1. Tony's goal has counted. Thiago injured, I just saw then. Is that, was that a thing or... Or is that not even really registering? We will just get this one done and out of the way. Darwin Nunes absolutely key three goals for him really good performance i'm going to say that we're pleased because the boys did play well shame about andrew robertson obviously not ideal newcastle have just smacked man city 4-1 and alexander isaac hat trick Fabinho is out for four to six days. No problem. Robertson is banned for one match. There's no point. The unfortunate thing is, is that he's missing a game against Chelsea. We paid Benfica £1 million as he's scored 30 league goals.
Okay. Oh, here we go. We're possibly looking to get some money from Marne now. Yeah, it gives Simakas a good opportunity to come in and stake his place. Thirteen wins in a row. We love to see that. Okay, he's definitely on my radar. I imagine they are going to scout him right the way through. I'm very interested to see who they've got. I can't even see who they've got up top. Arsenal, I'm intrigued. Saw an Arrojo. There is Henrique Arrojo, 21 years old, Portuguese. 14.5 million from Benfica. Benfica don't half make their, their coin, don't they? They do make some coin. Okay, we're just about favourites here. Samaka, player of the month. Diaz and Salovea. Fafana and Silva. Okay. A young player, I can win another manager of the month. What am I expecting? Always the same with Arsenal. Okay, so if I can view this. I don't know whether I can really. Delighted with positive. It might be. Disappointing finances. Team concerned about finances. I can see why we're 5 million in the red already. I can understand that. Robertson out. Simicas in. And we will change there and we will put in Calvin Ramsey. Let's get that out of the way. Fabinho is shattered. Hmm. Andre Santos can go in there. Other than that, Virgil's a little bit tired. We've got a couple of games. A couple of tough games here. And hopefully I should be able to give them some sort of rest. Let's go. Fire these boys up early. We know it's not going to be an easy game. Yellow card for Van Dyke there. It's a goal for Liverpool. Alexander Arnold, Van Dyke with the big header.
Just got to keep this up. That's got to be Salah. It has to be Salah. And he's missed another penalty. It's a regular occurrence at the moment with Salah. We're satisfied. It could be better. It could be better. We have just scored a second though. Luis Diaz, Andrew Santos, Henderson back to Diaz. Blast it past Turner and it puts us two goals to the good now. Superb from Jordan Henderson getting that ball through to Diaz there. That um that really helps from the uh the Salah miss penalty. And we got a goal for Arsenal, it looks like it's Saka on the right, cuts back, crosses and Odegaard with the what looked like a scissor kick volley there. Brings it back to 2 1. We're going to get the boys to focus. Sell up. It will replace him with Jota. We get ourselves a third. Henderson out to Simakas. Cross it in. Is that, is that is Jota? That's Nunes. And Arsenal have got themselves one back as soon as they can. Odegaard again. I really do rate Odegaard. I have done for a very long time. I'm going to be completely honest with you. I think he's an absolute bowler. Excuse me, Harvey Elliott is going to come in. Trent is shattered as well. As a matter of fact, a lot of the team are knackered. They've got 15 minutes. Van Dyke. Is out. Konate comes on. Is that Harvey Elliott who's just scored? Oh yes, Ramsey with a great run. Harvey Elliott taps her in, makes it four two. Get the boys to focus. Got ten minutes to go. Holding out here and we will get through into the next round of the FA Cup with a really tricky tie as well, this one. And that throw for Fana has made it five. Henderson with a long ball, Jota, easy cutback. Look how many players we've got in there. For Fana nods it home, makes it five. Superb performances. Superb. Very, very pleased. Now, I'm intrigued to see my run of fixtures. We've got Chelsea at home next. Kind of hoping for a slightly easier game. Oh, Od Odegaard, he fully deserves full credit there, if I'm going to be honest. 225k, Diaz on form. But I do appreciate that goal. I'm, gonna, I'm never going to lie about it. Okay, so we've got a couple of big away games. We've got. I might have to play reasonably full strength against Chelsea. Just because that is a really tough and tricky tie. With Liverpool Stadium development coming along, are you beginning to feel? Yeah, absolutely. Totally forgot that was even a thing, to be honest. FA Cup quarterfinals. We've got a view of draw.
Brighton Tottenham Liverpool Ipswich a favourable draw Ipswich made the quarter finals of the FA Cup fair play Forest will play West Ham and leaves Palace and Everton I'll tell you something Tottenham Fancy Tottenham, I fancy West Ham, and I probably fancy Everton there. Could be a uh, really interesting uh, game, but that is a game. They are first in Skybet League One. They're not going to be any mugs. I'm not going to underestimate them, but I might be able to rest some players there. The one problem I would say about Football Manager is they just haven't really got enough answers. It's been the same answers for a lot of years. Right. So, Andrew Robertson should be good to come back. Ramsey, we will swap. Andrew Robertson... Okay, let's just check how's now. Alexander Arnold is not great there, so it might be a case of sticking Fabinho on. Other than that, it looks pretty much like it is. I'm going to play Conate in this one, give Silver a break. And this is quite a big game, in my opinion. Firmino is starting. Come on in, boys. Let's keep this win streak going. Chelsea do owe us one. We have stuck a couple over them. So far, it's not particularly the most riveting of games. I just, in, I'm in a real life situation, can't stand the way Chelsea play the game. I just don't feel as though they're a good football inside. Their, um, the formation they play, Firmino has put Chelsea one nil up. Complete nightmare. Oh, it's way too easy. Firmino gets in behind. Cucurella with the ball in. That's not good. Nunes has equalised. And it looked like it might have been ruled out. Let's just check this out and see if we can see anything. Oh, he's miles offside, isn't he? No? Okay. We'll take that. Unless there was a player behind him that I didn't see, but to me that looked like a an offside goal there for me. It's one one. It's not been great. I am disappointed. They've got to go out there and they've got to do better than this. Trent is nearly out. It won't be long before he's uh, comes off. I'd like to nick a goal before he does. Nunes has got himself a second. Trent with the assist, I'm guessing. Oh, it's, oh, it's bad defending. Nunes comes in. Heads home. Makes it 2-1 to Liverpool. We will make that change with Alexander-Arnold right now. We will bring on Fabinho. We will also give Andre Santos a rest. Yeah. We will put on 
Joe Bellingham when I can eventually get to him. Oh, I'm having a nightmare again. Thiago will sit in the hole. Okay, let's go. Is that going to be another goal? I'm just about to fire us up. It is another goal. It's Andrew Robertson. Crosses in. Poor. Oh, it's easy for Darwin. Kula Barley has been stolen away from. It's Nunez's hat trick. He is in dreamland right now. Salah we will replace with Jota. That is completely fine. Have Liverpool got a fourth? I have Luis Diaz plays in Darwin. Oh, it's a little dink. It's it's embarrassing really for Chelsea now. One nil up they went. We have uh, completely dominated this second half. Known as four, Chelsea one. We will praise the boys. They have played really, really well. Chelsea have got one back. As soon as I put the praise in, it's a ball over and Sterling is in. Smashes it past Allison. Probably a little bit too late. We are going to go defensive. Try and see this game out. Van Dijk has had enough. Antonio Silva will replace him. 4-2 is the final score. Please. Happy with that result. Quality there from Dalton. Pleased to get the win, to be honest. Bellingham is now one appearance away. As we now move on to playing Braga. Games are thick and fast at this time. Manchester City are a convincing 4-0 victory. After reviewing Andrew Robertson's conduct, I'm going to repeal it. A further two game ban. Not what we needed at all, to be honest. Although Simakas has been really good. And if we've got to play him, we've got to play him. Um, some big games there. Yeah, we're going to have scout reports galore again. Michelle Gomez. I don't think I still need to really uh, head towards like Bellingham or Rice. The players are in a confident mood. We've got Wolves away in a minute and Wolves have been performing quite well. We need to manage what we do here we're at home so Fabinho is suspended which is not ideal obviously but it allows for Joel Math no Calvin Ramsey we definitely need that there we will put silver in 
purely because it's Portuguese playing against some of his old team. I don't think I'm going to change a lot else. They all look fit and healthy and well there, but we know how that can change very, very quickly. Teams warming up. Here we go. And away we go. Try and fire these boys up. We're at home, I expect to get a, a result here at least. So far it's been a little bit cagey. Nunes has put us one to the good. A long ball from Robertson. Diaz crosses in. Darwin smashes home. We are 1 0 ahead. We've hit the crossbar. Thiago has now scored. Santos hits the bar. Salah pulls it back. Thiago is there to wrap around. Put us 2 0 ahead. Good first half so far. More than pleased, and we've just got ourselves a third goal. Salah running at the defence, running through. Nips it home. Easy. Playing some really, really good stuff at the moment. It's Darwin Nunez. He gets his 40th of the season. You heard me correct. Four, that's a great finish. 40th of the season. Had you have said to me at the start of this save that Darwin would have come in and scored 40 probably wouldn't have said that you'd have been telling me the truth he has been a revelation the goals we have scored this season have been pretty extreme to be honest we're going to have to make some changes soon Luis Diaz and Alexander Arnold will be the ones that make way I've literally just paused it as Nunes is about to have a go on goal. Calvin Ramsey will come in at right back. We will also take off Andre Santos. For Harvey Elliott. Thiago can go back to a more deeper role. Robertson picks up yet another card. Demanding more from the boys. Calvin Ramsey is really not happy. Neither is Simicass. We have just got ourselves a fifth goal. Salah over the interception. Cross and Diogo Jota. Just off the bench. Gets his head to it. Back of the net. 5-0. Praising the boys. It's been complete dominance. Sell up, we will replace him with Garnacho. I 
literally in the last couple of minutes it's no problem at all we will take a 5-0 win here pleased can't be dissatisfied with that put five past any team it's normally going to be good enough to win the game so Manchester United and Arsenal win Chelsea to lose at home to Feyenoord it's going to be really interesting what do you make of the criticism Liverpool received for the number of players loaned out from the club giving players opportunity basically to uh, learn their trade outside to be honest because they're not going to be good enough to be getting a lot of games here I've only loaned a lot of players out because I've bought them. Okay, so Andrew Robertson is banned for two games. It's not ideal. This is a big game, this. City are away at Bournemouth. I fully expect them to get a result there. They do 2 0 away at Bournemouth. A bit of a tougher test here for me. Right, Robertson, you are out. Simakas is in. Robertson out. Fabinho comes to onto the bench. Fabinho is going to start for me as well. Give Andre Santos a bit of a break. So... It's looking like Virgil van Dijk is slightly tired. I just want to check. Okay, so Virgil plays here. He can have a rest against Braga and possibly Ipswich. And then we've got a bit of a break. So we will go relatively strong here. Can't see why we wouldn't. Very important game this one. Fabinho looks like a bad fit in his 11. Long term, maybe. I just get the feeling that this is, this is going to be a tough game here against Wolves. They are a good side. I'm not sure why I praised the boys out. It wasn't meant to be a praise. It was meant to be a, a fire them up. I probably confused the life out of all of them, to be honest, by doing that call. The majority of it is us. We're just not working anyone at the moment. 25 minutes in and it is a ball draw. Definitely like a goal before uh, half time if possible. Nunes is indicating he wants to come off. We will replace him with Jota. That's not ideal. Jota with a point to prove. I'll put him, him on ahead of Fofana we've got a lot to do here I'm going to say that I'm angry Fabinho not a good reaction from him I am angry it's not been good enough let's be completely honest I'm demanding more from the boys now Henderson 
Henderson is shown a yellow card just as I was about to sub him off. Harvey Elliott is going to come on and replace him. A lot of these guys have been run ragged in all fairness. Thiago is nearly out of steam as well. Oh, what do we do here? I need to make... Okay, we'll just do that one sub for the moment. It's a goal, and it is a goal for Wolves. This is not good. It's a Jao Moutinho. Probably a 16, 17 yard header there. I've got to fire these boys up. Okay, right. So we're now going to we're now going to make some big subs here. We really got to try and uh, do something now. Salah has had it. This is not the game I really wanted to be losing. Right, Fafana will come on up top. Thiago has run his cause. It's going to be Joe Bellingham when I eventually find him. He is nervous. He's not overly too happy, but there is something I'm going to be trying here. Uh, come on. Why are you not working for me? We're going to try this. We're also going to get Alexander Arnold off, who is absolutely shattered. And we've got to go for this now. We've got to go very attacking. I'm demanding more from the boys. We've got 20 minutes. We need a goal. It's looking bleak. It really is. And that right there is not a good result for us. I am angry about it. I'm going to be completely honest with you. That's poor. So you come up with a Moutinho, but it's going to be goals been given to Raul Jimenez. So, we have been stunned there. We have lost 1-0 to Wolves. Poor game for us. It now closes a gap with City where we've only got one game in hand and three points behind. That right there, we will call the end of the episode. Um, our big win streak has just come to an end. Not happy. Um, we are right in the business end of the season now. We've got about two, two and a half months to go. Um, we, we've really got to push on now. We've got to really manage the team well, get our rotation correct and take it from there. So based upon that, please give us a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Um, turn the bells on for notifications when videos go live. We will catch you in the next one. Take care.